Hey everyone! Today I want to explain why microwaves make food soggy, whereas ovens keep food crispy. By doing some research online and performing a test in my own kitchen, I believe I've found a satisfactory answer. Let's begin by considering what it means for a piece of food to be crispy. When we say food is crispy, we're almost always talking about the outermost layer of the food. When we talk about crispy chicken nuggets, we are referring to the outside coating. The meat on the inside is still full of moisture. With most cooking methods, the food is heated from the outside, and so the outermost coating receives the most heat and so loses the most water. As the inside of the food heats up, it also releases water, but the water passes through the outside of the food without condensing because the outer layer and the surrounding air are both at least as hot as the inside. The end result is a crispy outer coating that has lost more water than the inside. But microwaves heat food in a very different way by causing the water molecules in the food to vibrate and create friction. Because of this, microwaves apply more heat energy to the moist parts of the food, meaning the inside of the food receives at least as much energy as the outside. In the case of a chicken nugget, the chicken on the inside is heated directly by the microwaves and releases steam. The steam starts condensing in the outer coating because the outer coating and the air around the nugget are relatively cool. Because the moisture stays in the outer layer instead of escaping into the air, the nugget ends up soggy. While it might seem like the microwaves themselves make food soggy, in reality, the sogginess comes entirely from the inside of the food. To confirm this, I took a piece of bread and left it in the freezer for quite a while until it became dry. I also toasted it to ensure almost all of the moisture in the center of the bread was removed. I then microwaved the bread for two minutes. It got hot, but it didn't get soggy. With no source of extra moisture, the bread stayed as crispy as it was when I put it in. The bread had at least some moisture in it, but it was evenly distributed, unlike many crispy foods, where the center has more moisture than the outside. It's pretty hard to avoid making food soggy in the microwave, but it can be alleviated somewhat by heating the food more slowly. This gives the heat more time to expand to every part of the food, so the steam is less likely to condense in the dry parts. Some microwavable food packaging comes with a strip of silvery material called a susceptor. It's a special substance that absorbs microwaves and converts them into heat. The idea is that the susceptor catches the microwaves and heats the outside of the food like a grill. This makes the outside less soggy. In the end, a regular oven will be much better at keeping food crispy, so if you have the time, you may just want to skip the microwave entirely. If you found this video interesting, consider giving it a like. Thanks for watching.